Hey! What's going on, everybody? My name is Chris, and welcome back to tomorrow. Let's play Golden Sun! Last time, we pretty much took care of the Flood's uh, Alton Mines here, but... People are still sad. There's more new cave to explore. So let's go take a little peek, skis, shall we? Uh, left here, there's nothing here. There is a sign that points to the left, though. It is a free control. I guess I guess it's more for the minecart. It'll go left! There's no switch. Well, it's, yeah, it's just a troll. There's no point for it. <laughs> Rude! Alright, so let's uh, go through this last lecture of mine. I'm sure it's going to be the shortest one, right? <sighs> it's not spoiler. <clears throat> Alright, remember this room, by the way. It's a little bit important later round. What could that mean, you may be wondering? Well, just wait and see. Ha ha ha! Oops, oh man, everyone's caught by surprise. Alright, um... Got it, I have an idea. Alright, we need Ivan to attack so he can use his new unleash that he got last time. Last time! Oh, there we go. Sly Leech. Uh, Balloon Fighter took 54 damage, and he didn't take back any synergy for some reason. I don't know what that's about, to be honest. Did it what that's about, and did it. Yeah. The skeletons are water based? You think they'd be earth based, right? Well, I guess they're blue, so I guess they're water based. I'm going. But, uh. I'm going off the fact that they, uh, they don't get any... Oh, we're going the wrong way, actually. I'm going off the fact that when you attack them with water stuff, it doesn't hurt them, like, at all. Go Lucky Metal! Very important. Hey, if we go the other way, it actually just loops around here, and you'll see, like, that, but you just run the risk of missing that treasure chest. He's level 16 scribe! Master the scribes play well! Ply well! HP is up by 7, HPP goes up by 3, attack by 4, defense by 1, agility by 3, 237 coins. Uh, so, apply well, restores 200 PP. Okay, good. For a second, I was really like, oh man, we have to cut the episode and figure out, like, based upon, like, you know what you did for cure and cure well. I was like, oh, you actually get more um, heal per PP if you use cure all the time instead. But this, it literally just doubles. So, 8 PP for 200 HP instead of 4 PP for 100, so it's the exact same value, so it's actually just worth it to use play well. Unless, you know, you're under 100 HP um, health taken away from you, in which case, well, obviously use play. Also, show us off, if we trade uh, a, a Mia and uh, Isaac Jin. okay, we don't get that ability yet, great. Uh, let's do another one. There we go. So, this! We haven't used this before or seen it. Uh, encounter Fear Monsters, avoid! I actually looked this up on my practice file because I was sick of fighting every two seconds. Why does attack stuff? So, they are exactly sacred feathers. Just make some synergy. <gasps> Except in synergy form instead of uh, feather form. So, we won't use this all the time. I do feel kind of over level at this point, and we have actually seen like every monster here, so maybe I will occasionally use that uh, as we go through. Plus, you know, you don't want to be too overpowered. I mean, it's like <clears throat> not fighting monsters kind of feels like it hurts sometimes, you know? You know, brother? Because it's kind of like, well, I mean, you're not playing the RPG the, the way the game wants you to play it, but I mean, you also have to consider, like, well, if you're. Fighting these guys when you're super overpowered, then maybe that's also not a good thing either. Let's use frost on all this Steve. So I think if we don't switch that switch. Wait, or wait, is the minecart down here? The minecart actually might be down here. Oh wow, we actually don't want to switch. Oh, never mind, we do. Right, because if we actually run over here, the minecart's not over there. So like, what the heck? That is it, you might be saying. That comes it to be. Oh, en français, my friends. En français! Sorry, that's racist. It's not really. Here's a minecart. Yeah, the minecart. We actually saw it before, so I don't know why I'm pretending like you can't see it. Uh, wait, what the heck? That's not the way the switch is facing. Well, you know, it's just how minecarts work. I played a Minecraft mod day. But when I was your age, I had to play Minecraft all the time forever. Brr. Um, is there anything? I feel there's. Oh, yeah, there is one other thing, one feature. We got, like, right at the beginning of the game, as soon as we got access to the minimap, that I never actually showed off, and I don't know why I never did that. Um, I just kind of forgot about it, actually. That is exactly why I never did it. 
Anyways, yeah, you jump on the air, you freaking hacksaw. This is Mecha Um uh, Don't know what his level is, unfortunately. Could not find the information on that. It's very poopy soupies. Oh, missed. Um, but he has 361 uh, hit points. Wow. Just these couple attacks. We'll, we might be able to do him in this turn. Um, he can use Tundra. He can use Drench. <laughs> Sorry. He can use Frost Sphere. And he can use Flea. Oh, he can use Ice Horn and Hail Prism as well. But he never got to use it. He just used a lame attack. He just used Tundra, the thing we've seen a billion times instead of Drench. We've rarely seen Frost Spear. I don't think we've seen her at all. Ice Arm, we haven't seen. Hail Prism, don't think we've seen that. Or Flea. Uh, Spritz. Give that to my. Um, effects of Unleashing a Battle. Restore PP. Party PP with Soothing Mist. So, yeah, this is actually really good. And this is even better. Take a look at this. Wish. Oh, a new synergy. When you get four uh, Jin, you can, um... Set, no, not set them. Oh no, what is it called? I forget what it is. Standby. Oh no, it is set. Okay, right, right, it is set. Right, right. Right, right, You can use Wish. And if you go to Wish, restore any PP to the whole party. Oh, it's so much better. It's so less click intensive. Um... Ooh, now... Well, I guess it's the calculations are a little bit more difficult to do on this. It's definitely not worth it. It's definitely more easy to use ply, obviously. It's like 100 peep or 100 hit points. What's 80 per person? Anyways, <laughs> Spritz um, gives a base plus 8 HP, plus 4 PP, plus 3 agility, and yeah, as I said, it heals everyone in the party by a very vague amount, apparently. I didn't find any information on how much it heals. Should I look that up? God damn, I'm pressing left, but I'm, yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna look that up. One second. Found it! Uh, Spritz heals everyone by 30% of their maximum HP, so that's actually pretty decent. Um, it's funny that the force Jin we get, which also gives us Wish, is does the same thing as Wish, essentially. <laughs> Except instead of uh, 80 HP to every person, it does 30 plus 30. Uh, it feels so much nicer to run through this cave without having to deal with mainsters. Well, they're actually gonna want to fight a mainster now, um, because we could use this for the final summon. Avoids effects were off. Perfect. Actually, here we'll do this instead. Good. Yes, excellent. Bam. Okay. So, I uh, don't think there's a whole lot of these left, but if you do not get force, a completely different cutscene plays out, and I'll show that after what cutscene we're about to see here. Well, first, hold on, let's, let's fight a monster. We can get fight monsters in here, right? Uh, hello? Maybe it has to be in here. That is a special room, so, yep. Yeah, cool, interesting. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, now we're poisoned. Oh, what a horrible situation. What a horrible night to have a curse. Uh, I guess we can weaken these guys a little bit. Um, you can defend there, Sir Isington. So, Sir Price Peter is Soothing Mist. I mean, we're mostly doing this just to the end. Hey, Shen. He's gonna die, isn't he? That trench is gonna die. Oh, of course it is. Are you kidding me? Alright, well, we got to see it, so now we just gotta defend and we can show off the final. Or sorry, um, the next the next Jin summon we could use. If we could get into another battle, please, that would be great. The one time you want to fight, there's nothing around. Look at that! Took so long to get in that battle. Alright, um, we could probably honestly just defend. This is Boreas, the god of the north winds. One of the weirdest... Things. It's like a. What? 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 <laughs> uh, I think that level 16. He got level 16 by defending. He maxed HP up by 8, PP by 3, attack by 3, defense by 1, jelly by 4. What a. I, I always thought that was really weird. Um, are you gonna get your Jin back, Mia? That would be great. Let's so go up this path here. Yeah, I didn't actually know. You can't. There's no monster. Random encounters in here. Watch for falling rocks! Do not strike wall! Rocks may fall! 
Wow, I like the rhyme there. So, you may be wondering, what's the difference here? Well, if you don't have force, there is, because, you know, obviously, there's a log here, just like we saw before. We hit the log. Pfft, what's the worst thing that can happen? Ah! Wait, did the log just move? Did it just appear? <laughs> uh, that's, this is not me, by the way. This is, this is automatic. <laughs> Yay! Very obviously 2D things. Oh, that sounds good. What was that roar? Um... Yeah, so, if you don't have forest, the following cutscene plays. And honestly, that's probably the first time I've even seen that cutscene since I was a little babby child, like 15 years ago when I played this game. 15? Is that right? Yes, actually, because I got this game, I think, for my 7th birthday. A 7th birthday. Um, well, we heard a roar down there, which might not- okay, good, I just want that last decision to set on Mia. And, wait. What? Uh, what did we just come upon? This is actually really cool. First time I saw this, I was like, what is going on? I'm so confused. Uh oh. But yeah, so that's the first time I see that cutscene since I was a little baby kid. And it's just interesting. <laughs> and they like thought that ahead. It's like they could have just made you go back and get forest and figure it out, but Hydro Statue appears. The boss of this area. So, Hydro Statue is level 19. Uh, Living Statues are level 17. Just compared here. Um, he has 1300 HP, Living Statues only have 540, and we'll leave the gold and XP till after the battle, and we'll see here. Um, he can use Frost frost Spear, he can use Tundra, he can use Water Blessing, he can use Drench, he can use Ice. Why is that thing here saying Restore? He can use Restore. On, oh, okay, he can use Restore on himself. Oh, okay, I see. Which uh, removes Sleep, Stun, Delusion, and Death Curse. Death Curse! Hey, right. no further ado. So by buffing up everything, buffing up Hillary Buff, Hillary Buff, bro. No, Mia has two healing. So we can also see you. If you press R here, it says that red synergy gains, but we actually lose. We lose wish. <laughs> Don't want to lose wish. So at this point, that you can seriously just dedicate Mia to doing nothing but using wish over and over again, just to keep your HP up, and you never have to worry about dying ever again. But where would be the fun there? Tindra. One of the easier moves you could have used there. One of the better moves. And we use Quartz. I'm not ready. I'm not ready yet. I'm not ready to use anything besides that yet. Uh, Zephyr. Yeah, we'll buff ourselves a little more. I think we'll go one more turn without having to worry about Spritz. It does, like, using, having Spritz does, like, put a, like, a bit of a relief. Just knowing I can heal everyone by 30%. It's also pretty scary putting Jin on standby because as you use Jin, like you lose HP, you lose like defense, you lose attack, you lose everything. So it's like it's really a catch twenty two. Yeah, you're gaining the ability to summon, but you're also like really weakening your own characters. Okay. Fine then. You hurt Ivan? I chop off your balls. Wait, what? I, I mean, you hurt Ivan? I'll use Granite and Spritz to heal up everybody, all my fans. Yeah, it's pretty fair. It circles everybody. Good. Good. Getting a little bit worried here. <laughs> Delusion, there we go. I mean, restore, there we go. <laughs> that seemed to use a Nito, Burrito. I was very confused. I just had that like note off to the side. That's why I was like paused there for a second. I was like trying to figure out like, why did I write restore like this? Uh, Fizz, he's on Ivan. This, he actually might die this turn here. 
I would actually be shocked if you didn't die this turn. That was a lot of damage just there. See, there's two more level three summons left to go here. 141. You think being water based, you think like a frozen attack like Boreas would actually do a lot of extra damage? I don't know what this guy's actually weak to. The fire, it is! Oh wow, he didn't die. What a strong monkey. This gross ass teeth. This gross ass red painted teeth. Just painted nails and painted teeth. That's supposed to be blood. Blood? Maybe. Uh, Alright. Uh, we'll weak to fire, so we'll use heat wave on you. Can you sleep on him? There is a point in the game where bosses actually become immune to sleep. Just as an FYI. That is not yet, though. Uh, but that is coming up soon ish. <laughs> a simple storm right after all, he survived all that crazy crap. So he drops 496 experience points and 2,400 coins. And you also get a lucky medal, which is awesome. We did it, Isaac! We beat the last water beast! I wonder why Alton's guardian statues turned into monsters. Isn't it strange? I think so too. You know what's up with this strange tiled room at the bottom of the mine? The guardian statues were created long, long ago. What are they, what are they for? Oh, look at that thing. Also, he turned to sludge. First, he turned to stone, then he turned to sludge. What a weird cycle of life these guys have. This chest is just behind the guardian statue. It must all be related to these runes buried deep in the mine. How do people get access to these runes before? There's no, like, entry or anything. I guess so. Hey, Isaac, we should check out the chest before we go. Nah. That'd be stupid. And we got the lifting gem. Which is actually incredibly helpful. This is like... <laughs> I would compare this to get like bombs in Zelda. Like when you get bombs in Zelda, you get you unlock a lot of stuff. And the lifting gem does unlock a lot of stuff. Uh, if you remember there's a boulder and veil that... Uh, there was a cave behind that we could actually go and explore now. As well as a whole bunch of other places. It's really quite crazy. But with that, we are pretty much done all 10. There is one more area we have to go and explore. Actually, we should just use retreat. Retreat! Retreat! I like the teleporting animation. Kind of reminds me of uh, Breath of the Wild when you teleport a little bit. And everybody happy. Is it true you, you found ancient ruins? That you saw? How do people already know this? Really? I always thought that mine had some, held some kind of secret. These found out sorts of artifacts. I wonder if they come from the Rayuans. Um, Alright. So... Remember, the people in this house are actually talking about runes and all that. Sounds like Mom and Pop, they've been acting weird ever since the runes were found in the mine. What if Mom and Pop knew about the monument in the mine? Well, the monument, there probably isn't much treasure runes in the runes beneath the mine. Why don't you forget about treasure? Just for a second. I had no idea there are runes beneath the mine. <laughs> really? Ancient runes on the bottom of the mine? You don't say. Cripes, get your runes down the mine. Gotta get that treasure right away. So it looks like the secret these guys knew about. How do they even know about this, by the way? Because they're talking about, like, things they found in the mine. That was the most eastern passage, so... Uh, we're gonna talk to everyone here. But yeah, so now that we defeat the last living statue... Or Hydro statue, I suppose. Everyone's happy in here again. So Hydro's creatures really were the guardian statues, huh? Sure was a surprise. I really gotta stop punching people. The little guardian statues always creep me out. I'm glad they're gone. Yeah, they are pretty creepy, alright. So, you may be wondering, like, what are the runes, and to be honest, it's never fully explained what they are, kind of a little bit. I was actually reading up and trying to, like, investigate as to why they, those are there and all that, and there is, it's kind of, for, not foreboding, um, that's what I'm looking for. You probably know what I'm trying to say here. If only they had, uh, left the water monster or two. This lady's weird. How can I truly be happy about those cute monsters? You found them cute? I'm a little weirdo. It's because their vision's gone. Ancient ruins and treasure definitely go together. What are you gonna do? So you can still find monsters if you go in deep enough to the mine. I go treasure hunting together. They're for those nasty beasts. They're pretty nasty, alright. Nasty. Oh, that's nasty. Village went right back to normal once the water monsters left. It's still a mess around here. Yep. The vine is full of holes and chasms, that's why I drain so well. <laughs> Thank you for explaining. Uh, item shop is what I have listed on my notes here. Is it down here? Oh, is it this one? Aha! Talk 
this kind of lady. A girl from Jian bought a lot. I wonder if she's on a journey. What? A girl from Jian bought all the goods of business. A girl from Jian? Who's that? Who that? Ooh, I know who that is. A girl from Jian was asking questions about what young warriors say. Cause she meant you guys probably. She's searching very hard. Okay, now I've crossed the line. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm not doing this on purpose, by the way. <laughs> I wonder what business that girl from Jian was with the warriors. I think the Silk Road is close, or at least that's what the girl from Jian said. Well, I hope she finds who she's looking for. So that sounds a lot like fancy, does it not? Maybe. Once the mines open again, we'll be get back on our feet. God dang it! That's two of them in a row I've punched! Um like I don't I was trying to put something else in there, but there's nothing really that's a short animation. Oops. Oh my god, are you kidding me? I don't want to switch the button. See, the issue is, the reason why I keep doing that by accident, I hope I'll run with everyone soon. Because you get L and R button in this game, right? And the L button and the R button, you could assign different synergies to it. Um, and one of them I have mind read, one of them I have force put on it. Thanks so much for defeating the Hydros and the Statues of the Mine. We'll go back to the working mines again. I already started mining the upper parts of the mine. Jeez. People still seem afraid to go into the lower depths. Yeah, I mean, if it floods, you're kind of dead. The water seeps to the mine shafts, and I bet the rock is very soft. Oh, I guess you could also be afraid of that as well. Now we're all the, uh, all the mine, the, the cats as expected. The rain waters will probably set there for a while. Uh, nope, there's no more water, dude. My dude. I want you to feed the water beasts. You're much obliged, you also help me build the village. Wow. You fought pretty well, despite all the foul water the beasts spewed out. Yep. Well, someone else, I remember who, but if you talk to him, comment on if he thought that when he killed the water beast, they would spew more water. Kind of weird that doesn't happen to me, honestly. You'd think that would be what would happen. Thank goodness the village is free from all that water. Strange chamber on the mines creeps me out. Yeah, it's pretty freaking creepy. It's like a weird cult thing, right? Anyways, um, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed, the best way to support me is by leaving a like, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Um, they, talk about the, they talk about the girl from Jian. We will find out more about that later, but we won't be going up there. First of all, though, there was something in the second part of the mine we have to go back and get. Uh, we saw a boulder in there that we can now um, take care of. Thanks a lot for watching, everyone. <laughs> I'll talk to you guys next time. Goodbye!